Hello. I hope you're well. I'm doing okie dokie. It's a, it was a very kind of nice day. It felt like fall, uh, which is rare for the middle of July. But, you know, sometimes, sometimes the weather be like, um, uh, yeah, um, play a couple hours of this again this evening, make a little more progress, probably run around, kill a bunch of things, see some political intrigue as it happens. Uh, I think we have a, a, a judge fight coming up, so that'll be fun. Every time I think of the judges in Final Fantasy XII and in Evil East as a whole, it makes me think of Judge Dredd. Because that's kind of what I, I... I actually have to know this now. Are judges in Final Fantasy base are inspired by Judge Dredd? Uh, uh, doesn't say. Okay, well, the internet has failed me yet again. I don't know why I continue to believe in it. Which is to keep the law and have held this position since their initial appearance in Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. Oh, they're in Type O as well. I forgot about that. Uh, da -da -da -da. The in game moderators, game masters. <laughs> Appeared in the form of judges and were capable of using exclusive magic and ability. That's pretty dope. Uh, judges serve under the Ministry of Law in the Arcadian Empire. I just wanted to say, where's their inspirations? Please, please. Nope, nothing. All right. Well, shit. Even still, because of what their their because of what their purpose is in the world, it makes me think that they were inspired by the judges from the world of judge. You know, the, uh, the judge, jury, and executioner of their particular domain spelled d-e-m-e-n-s-e -E -E because i'm fancy not really but <laughs> you know i do need to play some more triangle strategy it's been a, it's been a week or two um the game's still good like i like triangle strategy just fine and uh i don't know if you're looking for a game that's Kinda like a tactics, but also kinda not. Good choice. Uh, also, Tactics Ogre exists, and that's almost identical to Final Fantasy Tactics because it's written by the guy that wrote this, who created the world of Ivalice, and was the director, I believe he was the director and writer of Final Fantasy Tactics. You know. I should play the Super Nintendo version of that game because I have the ability to do so. Um, I need to mod my PSP and throw some emulators on there so that I can play some. Why haven't I done that yet? I have a PSP. I hardly ever play it. I got a bunch of games for it that are good to play. Why haven't I thrown an emulator on there to play like in bed? That thing doesn't hurt my hand nearly as much as the Switch does. Back to Mount Claromi says where we will see what has happened. After we do some selling and buying. That were a surprise, none of it good. Whole empires worth of troops must have been on that airship. None of none of my wares were taken. Up next. Are you enjoying your gunpla? I hope so. I'd probably get into Gunpla if I had a place to, to do it, uh, but my space is occupied by 
this. And I don't have another table. Ah, that's not bad. Do you use X-Acto or do you have like little scissors that you use? Use both? Okay. Little scissors to get them out and an X-Acto to kind of file it down. I'm assuming. Also, Dragoon, hello. I forgot to say hello to you at the beginning. I'm sorry. Do I want to get rid of this? Get rid of these stress marks? Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, I am going to buy this. This is the Knight's monograph. Huntsman's crossbow, sure. Not actually an upgrade. Also, not an upgrade because I have one. Sell it. What of these do I have two of? Two of these. Get rid of one. Um, if you've never watched a Gundam, uh, the ones that I would recommend, uh, if you can watch it, uh, 08th MS Team, very good. Um, if you want Zany, uh, Mobile Fighter is okay. It's really stupid, but it's fine. It, the Gundams are cool. Um, Iron Blooded Orphans is is pretty good, and uh, comes recommended as well. Uh, I've heard good things about Unicorn. I've watched a couple episodes of it. I think it's only three. I think I watched like one and a half. It was fine. It's on Netflix. Um, I'm trying to think if there's any others. I don't recommend Wing because Wing is dumb. But Wings got cool Gundams, so. Okay. I've heard that the movies are pretty good, like Char's Counter Attack and all that kind of stuff, uh, if you can handle 80s anime. But 80s movie anime is way different than 80s television anime. 80s movie anime is good. Uh, oh, nice. And yeah, pretty much the only thing I like about Wing is the Gundams themselves. They look really cool. Ooh, that's powerful. Yeah, I'll buy it. I have that. Maybe, maybe it's just my mom having a TV that's very loud. That is possible. That might be what I'm hearing. All right. Cool. Well, that was nice. Um, I already did my licensing. Why does Bosch have so much? He don't need it. I uh, mean. I was saving up for something for him, wasn't I? Oh, I think I was. Good. Wait, no, I wasn't. I had nothing to save up for. He just... Bosch is already, like, where I want him to be. Hmm. Eh, he could stand to have better accessories, I guess. Yeah, I'm sure. Well, I mean, I guess it... No, I, I imagine. I imagine. Uh, I have one that my brother gave me. Uh, it's uh, it's Barbatos. It's not... Not the fancy one. It's just the first stage. He's really dusty. Let me sit here. Mm -hmm. I, uh... Yeah, you've got the one with the tail. Uh, I forget what they call it. It's been a while since I watched IBO. IBO was the reason I got, I kind of like got into Gundam. Um, I think I started watching it randomly because I'd heard some people talk about it. I was like, yeah, I'll, 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 I'll download that and watch it. Uh, I pay for my anime now. Don't come after me. 
uh, litigious overlords. Um, but I, I downloaded and watched that and was like, this is really good. I should watch more Gundams. And then proceeded to watch Wing and Mobile Fighter G and went, these are dumb. <laughs> August? August is fine. It, Gundam is never about the main character. In a way that, like... They kind of... In, in a way that this game is not about Vaughn. Like, it's about what's happening around them. They're just kind of the, the audience surrogate for, most, for the most part. Though, in IBO, he does have a little more of an import because of cool he is, but, like, it's it's everybody else in his group. Kind of how Kamiya is, uh, sort of the main character of Gurren Lagann, but he dies. Sorry, spoilers. Oh, no, Gundam Wing does not hold up. It's very bad. It's very... It's, Gundam Wing is, is interesting because, like, it has a story that it tries to do things with, but there are some plot... There are some jumps within the plot and like how they tell the story that do not stand any type of screw. They're just kind of, it's like, hmm, hmm, that doesn't work. Are we about to get major story bits? I'll probably stop talking about Gundam for a moment. I'm like, you must not go near the temple. The judge is still there. His grace, Anastasis, attempts to reason with him. Within. And he's dead. Pardon. Nice. Making some good progress, sir. Ah, our vagrant princess. Swift as your lust for revenge led you to the Sword of Kings. <sighs> you will surrender it to me. Too late and to their sorrow do those who misplace their trust in gods learn their fate. There it is again. King Wraithwell. It even looks like, like it looks like his... Fran, I don't like the look of that. This mist. He holds a stone. It controls him as it did Mjern. No, no, the power of manufactured nethersite is the power of man. Oh. A weapon forged by his wisdom who would challenge the gods themselves. He's a crypto a bro. Blade for All the right, true cool. Dynast king. Wraithwall did but pretend the title, a curb begging nethersite scraps from his master's table. Hark! Ivalice hails her true dynast king, Vane Solidor. He shall defy the will of the gods and see the reigns of history <laughs> back in the I hands am of man. His still playing this game this weekend, I will probably the do the Nethysite drinking game no place if I'm doing stories stuff. Down Masca. The stain of Wraithwall's blood shall be washed clean from history's weave. Wait, there's others? There's others. Oh yeah, speed. This will take too long on this. Look at that damage. Hell yeah, Fran. Get him with that that horology. Appreciate that. Oh, that's like super I should not be using that it's too strong <laughs> you know what fuck it I'm still using it don't care minus the W horology <sighs> is the study and measurement of time
He set his very bones about with manufactured nethersite. Oh damn, ten chain quick ends. There you go. Wait, what about Larsa? Gone, spirited away by Judge Gabranth. Damn it, Esther. Gabranth. You okay? So he was here. Ah, as for our young lordling, he went along to avoid trouble, you see. But Judge Bergen oh, had other ideas. He flew into a rage, and I was left to fend for myself. I don't Please, know if I've princess, any you must bring me to take you back with me to Rosaria, so that you can protect me. I would lay down my life at a single word to be sure, but I harbor no maundering delusions of valiant grandeur. Vain has our war pavilion jumping at shadows. Oh, they favor the a preemptive and, and strike, and but you, you will convince them otherwise. Oh, no, I ran away from You her. will see that they do not start this war. This I cannot do. I do love how Forgive easy it is me, to run away from just But my errand here is not yet done. I must wield the sword of kings, and with it bring an end to the Dusk Shard. <sighs> this stone, do you even know what it is? I can venture a guess. The Draclaw Laboratory in Arcades. The Empire's weapons research begins and ends there. How soon do we leave? At once. As for matters in Rosaria, I bid you luck. <laughs> so you would leave each to fend for his own. Let us hope that you are not disappointed. <sighs> ah, that's right. Larsa left a message. The differences between our two lands will fade before the shared dream of men. Oh, I thought he was pulling out a pipe for a second. I take. I was about to say, uh, he wasn't smoking a pipe earlier. Later, I'll Sid. Sid two. Sid dose. Sid do. Sydney. How do you propose yeah. we reach Arcades? Arcadia's borders will be well guarded for fear of Rosarian invasion. We dare not approach by air. And their navy will see that the coast is watched as well. No, we go afoot. We'll cross into Arcadia in the Salica Wood. We can reach the wood any number of ways, but the easiest is to head north from Nalbana. There is a hunter's camp just beyond the Salika Wood. The camp sits within Arcadia's borders, so Imperial patrols there should be sparse. Getting that far should be half the fun. Let's be sure we go prepared. Joy. Arcadia's is actually pretty cool. I like that area. It's a it's a neat town. Rain fucking with my uh, capture. Hey, it's What are, Nate, what are the differences in rewards for defeating the demon wall? Because from my understanding, the only thing that changes really is that if you defeat the first demon wall, Mont Blanc gives you like a thousand gold or gill and uh, something else. Hot time. Uh, okay, so I've done the thing. Uh huh. Uh -huh. An optional esper in this. Ooh! Hold on. Speak to the acolyte walking in front of you when the scenes are over to receive the stone of the condemner. <gasps> hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I want bonus esper. Let's go. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, but also one thing to consider too is that there are a ton of treasures you cannot open if you want to get the Zodiac Spear. 
I don't know if I'm gonna get the Zodiac Spear, but like, I like being able to open treasures. It is a weird, obsessive, compulsive thing that I have about the game. You, you, you? Hume, child, do you seek greater power? Know then the fate of those who have fallen in their search for strength in the distant past. The great condemner too sought such power and was stricken down by the god. Even now his spirit is bound within the still shrine of Miriam. Stone in hand and walk the paths into dark. Yeah, I don't really like the RNG chests either. I that's one of the only things I think that kind of It's a small Mar on an otherwise kind of peerless game. And I say peerless because if you look at when this game came out, what, 2006? And you compare it to any other JRPG around that time, although you're getting close to the personas at that point, um, it, it kind of stands like heads above anything else that came out around this time. Just in terms of like sheer quality and I think story, like uh, when did it was two thousand six. Yeah, Persona three was two thousand six. Four was two thousand eight. And twelve was March. Yeah, no. Maybe I'll play Persona 3 when the remake comes out. Probably won't. I do plan on playing Persona 4 at some point. Genuinely, I mean that. Been sitting installed on my computer for two years. Thank you. Oh yeah, where am I going? Boop. All right, we are on to part four. Of six. I've never played Persona 4. I think I own it on PS2 as well. Yep, I do. All right. Uh, none of the story is completed, and you are required to head back to Damascus. You can finish up some hunts and progress some side quests. All of them will be available at this point until the end of the game. Oh, I can go talk to What's Her Face and answer the last question. I think I'll do that real fast. Um, I can also do the white moose hunt, ringworm hunt, which I think I did. I can complete the rims at sandstorm task, hunt Marilith, the that that pesky fire snake from Final Fantasy One. Oh, I don't think she was called Marilith in the original version. You know what? That makes sense that it would be pronoun kitten. pronounced kitten. I don't know. The area have names that I can't pronounce. But if they're Icelandic in their original presentation, I mean, why would they call her Fran when her sister's called Mjern? It is weird. Uh, I want to go this way, right? I mean, this gets me. So. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. There is more to her name than simply. Right. Hello, lady. I am happy to see you visit again. Talking with you somehow makes my burdens feel lighter. Even though I'm admonishing you the entire time. I have left my home and I can never return. I had no doubts when I set out, but no, I w now wonder whether I will fail where my sister did not. It would not be right to turn to my sister for help. She is now an accomplished warrior, but for me, no allure does the call of battle hold. Others have said I possess a warmth of care my sister lacks. Still not on kindness alone can one make her way in the world. Perhaps it would be best if I too became a warrior like my sister. What do you think? I think it's a good idea. 
What the fuck is wrong with me? No, that's fair. I guess. I thought as much. I will join a clan and learn to fight as my sister. She's gonna die. And it's gonna be my fault. But I have no skill in battle. Even should I join a clan, I may be more burdened than aid. Ah, <sighs> forgive me. I always seem to look at what is not instead of what is. Pray, speak with me again soon. Never. All right, now that that's done. Uh... <laughs> Hold on. Okay, so after I talk to her... Use a question to get the item you want and where to find the hidden change. Claim your reward. Oh, um. I don't know. There's a table that I'm looking at that happens to tell me, like, what I want. Example, left the wood, but it has been easy pass for me to walk. I talked to Mom Blanc, don't I? Don't I? Gives it to me. Let's see. Hold on. You missed answering one earlier. She will continue to ask follow up questions, but you have to wait for a little bit. So do a couple side quests or hunts and check back. Aha! Or we'll just teleport back every time you unlock a new teleport destination. Here's what else you can do. I'm gonna go talk to Mom Blanc real quick. I'm sure there's some shit that I unlock. I don't know, everything I told her to get the rune blade was like what I would not, the advice I would not give for the most part. Kupopo, you're a headhunter already. You've been burning the midnight oil, Kupopo. I was a headhunter before. Clan Centurio knows how to treat its hardworking members. Kupopo, here, a reward for your accomplishment. Keep up the splendid work, Kupopo. Here you defeated the Elder Work. Impressive, Kupopo. The Viera Wood Warders send you this for their compliments. And thanks for stilling the anger of the wood. Here you defeated Tiamat, impressive, Kupo. The Hene Miners Guild send you this for their compliments. Given a notice of labors undertaken to lessen the dangers we daily face. Here you defeated Inuska, impressive, Kupo. The Platinum Guild send you this for their compliments. And thanks for providing us with the most singular example of platinum for Vinuskar's skin. Another. I feel like that's undervaluing that, to be honest. Oh, I have a bunch. I can... Oh, an antlion. Apparently antlions are real creatures. Oh, yeah. They are. Look at that. Oh, and they become, uh, they become flies of some kind? Neat. YouTube, this is the Smith, the Smithon, Smithonian, God damn it, the Smithsonian channel. The title of the video is "This Antlion is a Devious, Cold-Blooded Killer." Uh, the antlions are a group of about 2,000 species of insect in Neuropteran family, Myrmillionidae. Okay, I, I think I pronounced that mostly correct. They are known for the predatory habits of their larvae, uh, which. Mostly dig pits to trap passing ants or other prey. Oh god, they look like they hurt. Oh god, I don't want to look at that anymore. Ah, it's got so many legs. Ah, get out of here. I really don't like bugs. I like, I like, I like finding out about bugs and like reading about bugs. I'm, I will be forever enamored with spiders. I do not want to be anywhere near them. I do not want them to be on or around me. And I wish that they would all burn fiery deaths forever and ever and never return. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyway, um, all right, so let's do the white moose hunt because I can. Uh, wait, do I have it? Actually? Oh, really? See, little froggies are cute. I don't really want to be around frogs either. And I would say most reptiles, as long as they got legs, they're okay. I mean, I lived with a person who had a bearded dragon, so I, I, I was kind of exposed to that for a little while. Um, I always have like little sharp claws that kind of hurt, uh, even if they're not like 
eh, eh, eh. they're just kind of like here's my claws i just need them to get around and it's like, Ugh. but snakes snakes kind of weird me out just because the way that they move is hypnotizing in a way that is very unsettling um license uh no Climb. Yeah, that would do it. That would do it. That would do it. Um, what am I going for? Oh, yeah, I did that. <laughs> Balzac. Um, I did that. Ah, this is... Yeah, that's Merilith. Okay. I can do a couple of these. We'll do the white moose because it's just, it's here. Very easy to do. Um, I can actually probably... Where is there? There's an exit to Low Town on the other side of this here. I can't believe I have not explored the... That's not gonna do it. It's um, mice don't bug me that much, but I don't see mice very often, thankfully. Um, I'm generally okay with cute creatures. Even if some of them are just annoying shits. Kind of the benefit of being a cute creature, you're just an annoying shit all the time. I see chipmunks don't bug me either. Hmm, yeah, that would that would do it. That would be a mild annoyance that I would not want to deal with. Alright, where is this thing? Motown North Roll, take the south exit from Overflow Cloaca. Am I in the Overflow Cloaca? I think I am. I am the south exit. Oh, the only exit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. Uh, head west from there using one of the middle of the four west exits into the maze like number 10 channel. Now this is the number 11 chip. I did go west, right? Now this is the number 11 chip. Overflow Cloaca. Number four, Cloaca Spur. Not where I want to be either. I want to be in the... Oh, my God. I want to be in the number 10 channel. One of the one one of the middle four exits on the west side. Let's see what happens if I go to the east side. Oh, God damn it. This is the west side because the map's upside down. This is number three. I can read maps. I swear. I swear I can read maps. There we go. Number 10 channel. All right. Where am I going? Southwest exit to the West Sluice control. I need to go back because I'm not in the right spot. I don't think I can. Uh, now nah, we can get there. Got to fight some Malboros. Uh, and actually, mm, sorry, Fran.
west lose control that's where i want to be yep clear out all the marlboro over kings on the upper path and be healed up before descending the stairs to the lower level oh they got little crowns oh that's cute if only these things didn't suck my ass Fucking hate me. This man. All right, Pinello. Okay, good. Thanks, Pinello. All right, here he is. A white moose. He has something on him. Missed. Okay, get him, Bosh. You got this, Bosh. Do I need to worry about you, Bosh? I maybe do. Oh, he just keeps giving me poison. Okay. Shit, I gotta push a button. I fucking forgot how these work. I'm not gonna have enough time to get more than one now. More, more than one extra. In an infoino. I'm lucky. And I didn't do a whole lot of damage. Here's what I want to have happen. I want Pinello to attack. I want you to attack. Because both of you is, is, does decent damage. Uh oh. Hold on. Get in here, friend. Horology is ass. It's not doing a whole lot of damage. Oh, she's doing antidote and shit too. Yeah, it's not doing a whole lot. I made a mistake. Never brought Fran.
attack his dumb ass. That's fine. God, I have these two left. <laughs> yeah. Might die. My game is not set up right. Of course. Ball fear with the with the fire that with the fear of just bleh, done. Let me swap some party members out. into that poorly planned is what happened. Oh, and Ash doesn't have any this in the homeboy. I don't remember how to get I don't even remember where he's at. And horology is nothing. With that move. With that white flan. Uh, this way to get out. Can't get him, Bosch. Captain Bosch, here to stay. Oops. No, this is not where I wanted to go. Blah. Uh, I want to go this way. into the over. I know oh, this is the central area. There is a thing I can do with that. I'm not gonna... <clears throat> go back to the west gate to find Sorbet. Oh, I know where Sorbet. Sorbet is the the Moogle that's at the Moogling. Let me traipse around. There is a Moogling down here somewhere, I believe. Or not. Don't need it. More RAM tomorrow. I'm excited. Hopefully it gets here before I start stream.
Escape. Escape. Ah, but the Moogling's right here. Talk to the stupid Moogle. Oh, you have the key. That means you defeated my wobbly white nemesis. Thank you ever so much, Koopa. You've saved this poor Moogle's honor. Now to get my brother to repair it. I'll be back in two shape. Repair your honor? Don't give a shit. Oh, he's back. Sorry to keep you waiting, Koopa. My brother's repaired the key, but not before a serendipitous message arrived from old Dolan. He found another key that works, so he doesn't need this one anymore. Sorry for wasting your time, Koopo. It wouldn't feel right keeping the key now, so I want you to have it. It's the least I can do after all you've done. Yay. I have the sluice gate. The sluice gate key. Um. Ice cream. It's in the store right there. Uh, okay. Where to now? Uh, go to Domasco Westers and... Teleport stone is in. Uh, can I, I can. Wait. Can I teleport? Oh, wait. You have one in the Westerson? No. No, you don't. No, you don't. Uh, teleport. Oh. Maska Easterson. Westerson. The Damascus. This one might be tricky. I find this foe begin by teleporting here. It may only appear during a sandstorm, so use the east exit into the Westerson. Uh, if it's not a storm, then rezone. Take out the nearby creatures and find the ringworm due east of the entrance. East entrance. That's this one. Oh, good. Easy enough to find them. Look at me taking these fools out. I feel bad. Uh, is this the group that I want with me? Yeah. Hey, look, there he is. Symphony of the Night sound and sound effects there. Also, that's the the Guile Overdrive thing. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Shit. Oh.
get that in a second next. Thank you for the Meowth everywhere. Hopefully I can do this. Hell yeah, we're getting we're getting ten hits on this. Let's go. begin wind burn he dead A shit ton of damage he ain't dead yet he's dead and my character's like out of everything. All right. However, it's waited long enough. It is time. You know what? I love it. No, you know what? I know it. I love it. And I hope you do too. It's Meowjima. It's Meowjima time. Thanks, Nex. 690 points well spent. I appreciate you, sir. Alright, so that guy's done. Go back to town now. Is good too because Yee. I have to use the restroom. Um who do I who do I turn this into? Uh head back to Robin Oscar Lotan knows for all. Oh yeah, Balzac. His name is Balzac. Two balls act. It was like right here. Mm. And then I might try and do this Earth Tyrant fight. I don't know. This seems a bit out of my 
my ability range. Ooh, what's this? I'm not mistaken, Balzax. Did I turn off Bonds? Yeah, but I think it did. Here we go. <laughs> That's probably just down to you getting some good rolls. You did it. I didn't think you had it in you. Clearly it was wrong. Here's your well-earned bounty. A moon ring and an iceberg. Now, now that our problem's been dealt with, I should be on my way. I'm not getting much training done standing around here. Glad we had a chance to meet. This is the last time, well, take care of yourself. Thanks, Balzac. You have a funny name. You know, I don't know why samurais are magic based. That's a good question. Bosh, I do have shades of black with Bosh. I should set up a gambit for it. Let's see here. What's a, ooh, that's actually something I should do. I need to go buy gambits. Uh, hey, it's right here. Give me. Buy. Oh, status. Heck, I don't know why I didn't buy that one. Do that. What does sight unseeing do? Does it increase his damage? I should also go look to see what techniques are available. Foe item amount equal target any on-screen foe if 10 or more of the selected item remain. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Like that, like that. I also need to go grocery shopping. By groceries, I mean items. Uh, and remedies in particular, if I can do um, But I should hit the technique and magic shops just because. And of course I have more already. Large metal disc out of which the shape of a full moon has been carved, rumored to be a device for the entrapment of spirits. Perhaps I'm gonna keep it. I don't see why I would want to get rid of it. over here. I'm pretty sure I have all of the good magic right now. I mean, most of the good magic you find in random treasure chests spread throughout the world. Uh, yeah. Good. I doubt there's anything I can get from the weapon shop that it would be useful. Sundries are what I need. Hello, Miguelo. Remedies. 
absolutely worth it. Uh, now I can set up some, um, some remedy ambits. That'll be nice. Uh, you. Oh, you, that's the bolts. Bolts. The burning bow. What's it do? Burning bow. It, it does nothing. It just is a burning bow. Okay. Hmm. The recurve crossbow is useful. And I got stone bolts. And puts it at 58. This is already better. Uh, we'll do bamboo here. A soul. A soul damage. The Sword of Kings is actually an upgrade for him, even though it fucking sucks. Uh, let's see here. Let me see. What abilities do I have? Deal, first aid, numerology, shades of black, coach, traveler stone. to boosh sight unseeing okay unleash an attack only available when blind oh nice Here's that max hp shirt masa 240 to equip the Zodiac Spear? I don't even have it. Dragon Whisper. Uh, we'll increase that. She does so much damage, but she's my stupid healer. I should reset that and make her something else. Like, literally anything else. Oh, I meant to buy this for her. That's right. Yeah, I know, but she she does like more damage than Bosch does at this point. Consume users MP. No. Wait, what is this? Why not? Uh, Vaughn. You can have more HP. That's fine. Think of anything else to do for you. Black magic. You already have it all. I don't have any of the good stuff. Player. And bombs. Uh, I am going to give him another gambit since he is the black magic user I should probably use him more A Yoichi bow before I know it. You've already been done. You've already been done. You've already been done. Alrighty. 
Um, gambits. We'll set up some more for ball fear. Oops. Um. Oh, I thought I picked up the character status. Berserk. Whoops. Oh. Oh, status. Berserk. Cast. How do I not have blind? magic is it? No, it's black. Hmm. Oh, well. Well, that eliminates what I can do with this. Although... in from the west which is over this might be a little complicated I gotta do some stuff in order to trigger all of this I don't know if I really want to do this because I'm not perfectly set up for it. We'll do it anyway. If nothing, I'll come across a boss that I cannot beat and I will continue to go elsewhere. I don't think I'm going to be able to put up a fight, really. Trying to do Rimzat's thing here. Alright, so... Uh, head directly through Galtia Downs. I know what this is. Into the mid fault, which is, I would imagine, right in front of me. Okay, let's maybe turn that gambit off. 
right now just to save your magic. south immediately take the exit into the shimmering horizons all the north wall to the west run hold on follow the north wall to the west until you find the exit into the cut off portion of wind trace dunes Those are friends. Don't fight them. Okay, from here. Oh. Oh, that's a big one. Uh, there are two large dynast cactoids in the area. One of them has the wind globe buried in with its roots. Is that what this is? Something buried among the roots. I have the wind globe. Okay. Head back to Robin Oster Westgate. Northman, Grimzat, and Kotze are gathered together. Speak to any of them, your wind globe will be converted into a wind vane. like that I kill like every wolf I come across even if they are not aggressive I do. like they're saying that wolves are a bane on an ecosystem when really they're kind of integral to it otherwise too many pests like yeah they can hurt people but like they're only doing it because we're fucking up their shit and like, we shouldn't do that. Who's the real predator here? It's us. It was us all along. Always. All right. Hello, friends. I do not believe it. Well, we saw with our own eyes a strange sort of egg. It wasn't long before it hatched. It kept, it kept growing and growing. We were terrified. And now that I think about it, that's just about the time the sandstorm started getting worse. Hmm. Is that... Is that a wind globe you got there? That looks just like the one you used to have, Northern. That's because it is. Oh, wait, no, wrong. Let me have a look. I didn't realize Kote was the one that I gave a... There, this should make, let you make your way through the storm. I just need to decide whether that's really what you want to be doing. Well, that's about it. I can't think of anything we might have left out. After the help you've given me, it pains me to say, but I've been relieved of my commission to study the sandstorms. Lack of results, I said. I have nothing to give you by way of reward. Pray, keep the wind vane instead. I hope you will learn the secret of the sandstorm. Or I could not. May your troubles be safe. Why oh, it took me so long, Rimzat? Speak to any of them, your wind globe. Um. You can now find the Earth Tyrant, which you overheard the group talking about when you approached. Doing this now unlocks dialogue in an area you will be encountering soon. To find the Earth Tyrant, head back out into the Westerson, but this time head north to Corridor Sand. Make sure, make your way around east, exit into Worm's Nest. I'm gonna get my ass into to me, but I'm gonna try it anyway. Why not?
I don't know if I fought this thing the last time. I think I looked at it and went, no, fuck that. I ain't doing that. I mean, it has 73,000 health. It's all like, that's a lot. Just open horology does a lot of damage. <laughs> it won't. It won't. Actually, hold on. Uh, Ology damage formula. Okay, horology is a technique or er, technique in Final Fantasy XII that uses the game clock's minute to deal fixed damage to targets within a radius around the second selected target. Horology's damage formula was tweaked for the Zodiac versions of the for potential to do more damage, though it remains weak, especially when the party is on a low level. But it's so strong. In the Zodiac versions, horology can be found from shops after the party reaches the Leviathan. If they, in the Zodiac version, Serology can be used by three job class machinist, time mage, and bow breaker. The breaker must acquire the Esper Belias license first. The image is, uh, Zodiac version is L times X squared, in which L is the user's level, and X is the second digit in the game clock's minute. Oh. So it would be 30 times in this case 64 hmm. no traveler doesn't I, I, I'm here let's find out this traveler is another one uh, traveler damage formula FF Does it have the same? Okay. Uh, step mine is a lore spell for straight. No, that's Final Fantasy VI. I don't want six. I want twelve. Damn it. Okay. Uh, 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 can I acquire the Esperzilliers? This doesn't tell. Interesting. So, I get horologies, but I don't get. Oh, that's really interesting. Hmm. Step count damage. Hmm. Oh, here we go. It costs an amount of MP equal to the number of minutes the game has been played divided by 30, but not greater than 255. Oh, that's 556. God damn it. Uh. Button attend. Number of steps. Okay. Uh, around it. Oh, Causes physical damage target and multiple enemies around it based on the number of steps the player has taken since last dealing damage with it. Oh, that's interesting. So it like does good once and then don't use it again. You have to take more steps. It's not a continual thing. It's not based on your steps. It's based on that's really interesting. Okay. 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 I don't like that. I don't like it as much as I like horology. Horology is interesting because it can do more damage. Uh, let's see here. Damage dealt from using horology caps at 4,009 HP in the original version and 8,019 in the Zodiac version. Interesting. Yeah, I don't really like, I don't like Graveler. Horology is fun. Uh, I actually think it's a neat, it's a neat ability that um, I kind of dig. Uh, and the, the more, the higher level I get, the more powerful it gets, essentially. And as long as I'm using it in eight minutes. <laughs> All right. Hold on. Where am I? Am I? I'm in the quarter of sand. I need to go. Make your way around to the exit, east exit into Worms. I don't think I've been here. Bird people.
don't think I fought one of you. Oh, I'm going to. For the sake. Dang, I did. Ah, treasure. I seen you. Is there anything? I haven't, I haven't been here, so maybe there's like useful things in these chests. Chests, they're barrels. They're, I don't know why I call them chests. I mean, they're chests uh, for the sake of the mechanic of what a, a treasure chest does in a game like this. Is this the worm's nest? Oh boy. Oh, look at that mini map. What I'm doing is gonna be worthless. This thing is gonna fuck me up. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It. That's good. Oh, I do want to cast Berserk on him. Is two clones is out here bamboozling enemies. That's fun. Yeah. All three levels with Fran. Let's go. That's right, she does Shiva's diamond does essentially. That's fun. This is gonna do like no damage to this guy. <laughs> Nowhere near enough to kill him. I'm lucky it'll do like which were level three so that feels good i'll probably not get anything good out of it out. is this holy damage no nope. nice i don't think it matters with those though i did some damage oh man six Four of every level. Okay. Oh, it does. So it only, okay. Um, what did I want to do? Oh, nice.
Alright, he's berserk, which means he's just gonna do normal regular attacks. Based on the fear. You might be like, why would you haste the enemy? And the answer is because then he just does physical attacks and doesn't actually like bother my, my characters. I should have cast protect first. Anyway. We don't always do things correctly here. Double max HP of one out now. Stop doing screw tails. Screw tails.
Oh, it's close. Oh, shit. I did it. I did it. <laughs> Whiteout helped. <laughs> Took out like half of its HP, so that worked. And everybody gets experience points and LP from that. Not just those that were on the battlefield and I mean nobody was dead, so that works. Sick. Sick, bruh. Zertini in caves. Where does this take? Oh, hold on. You can turn that off. I don't need it if I'm not in combat. I don't know where this takes me, so I'm going to find out. Oh, the Easter Sands. Nice. Um, uh, I can get to that save crystal pretty quick. Light. Um. Ah, go back. I've like not moved the story forward really at all. Uh, I mean, I guess I went back to Mount Burrow and face and fought a judge and I beat his ass and uh, then I ran around and fought a bunch of other things. Um, where am I looking at? I want to go there and I can get there by just going. It's apparently not explored the right side of this at all. Oh, wait, who has the embroidered ticket? Anybody? These cuffs. All here does. Oh, 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 somebody's. Somebody needs to have. Since you are not in the party, you can have these. You've probably spent more time running around and doing random grinds. You're probably also not using a walk. Then. I'll use them in a little That's fine. See, it's funny. I don't use walkthroughs for bosses. <laughs> like, I, I look to see what their weakness is, and then I'll, I'll exploit it, but I generally don't follow what the walkthroughs say. And a lot of it uh, is because the walkthrough will be written by a person who's using a different setup than I am. So like a lot of what they, they might be saying to do doesn't fit with any of the gambits that I have uh, equipped or like any character builds that I have going. So like it, it, on the base level, it'll be like, hey, use this, this, and this. And it's like, cool. I mean, I did look at it for the Earth Tyrant because it had a lot of health and I wanted to see if I, I could beat it. And um, 
it's said to to use blind like it it the one of the main recommendations is cast berserk use blind oh she's still casting because then like they constantly attack and they they just don't have blind or they can't really attack because they're blind kind of thing I use it mostly to figure out where the hell I'm supposed to go. Because I don't generally have a whole lot of fun wandering aimlessly. Uh, it's part of why open worlds just don't appeal to me like they used to. Oh, he's a prince. Used to, and, and I mean, a significant part of that is like, I ain't got the time to just run around. I want to play too many different games for me to, to spend genuinely exploring a world. I think it's part of why I can't get into the newer Zeldas, just because, like, I I understand what they are. I respect them. I appreciate them. Hell, I would even say they're good video games. They're just not for me. And it, I, I've, I've said this many times on my, my, my channel. I think it's funny how people's opinions are just like instead of recognizing something for being good just because they simply don't derive any joy from it they instantly just call it the biggest pile of shit ever and i mean this is a practically any any form of entertainment but i find it really really funny it's like you can't even like see this for what it is and just be like yeah that's that's a cool thing that i'm happy the people that like it like it Maybe I'm just um, m much more forgiving. Where is this? Invitation to Heresy. What a name for a place. And some of the names of, of places in this game are, oh boy, they are definitely things. Like overflow of cloaca, yes. No, it's not overflow of cloaca. It's the overflow cloaca. Because I, th I believe cloaca is just a throat. Common cavity at the end of the digestive tract for the release of both excretory and, geni and genital products in vertebrates? What? Except most mammals and certain invertebrates. Archaic. A sewer. Just Google search it. Like. Oh, okay. In animals specifically, it's, it's like the rectum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But like. The dictionary terms, there's a zoological term, which is the butthole, essentially. And then the there's an archaic term, which just means sewer. And of course, because this game is like steeped in I want to be old English type stuff, you have a sewer. Oh, yeah, this is right. This is right. This is where I'm looking for. Oh, God. I remember doing this hunt and, like, coming in here and getting my ass handed to me by all these beasts. I'm having a much better time at this game than I did the first time I played. <laughs> oh, hey, look. Here it is. <laughs> I'm at time wise. Oh. Hey, Fran. You went a hasty, baby. Um, also, Pinello. Uh, Pinello will raise her. Yeah. Oh, 
some magic. My magics. Rotate. Light magics. Protect. Light magics. Protect. Brand. Try and do some of this. Maybe this isn't Marilith. Because I haven't been in here for five minutes. I must be strong. still don't understand why limit breaks have only gotten worse since seven mm, since eight i like the limit breaks in eight i think limit breaks in eight are just fine That's good. No. That's fine. Let's go, boys. We got this. Yeah. thing do so much damage holy shit okay I have to run if I don't everything is for naught I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I am. All right, good. I'm going the right direction. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh boy, did I get lucky. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm happy about that actually. <laughs> how many how many Twenty six? I was gonna stay and just die, and then I realized I haven't saved between now and fighting uh the um uh the earth tyrant and like that's been <laughs> Oh, that sucks. I hate dying to elementals. Elementals suck, man. They're so powerful. Oof. Oof. Sorry. Sorry, friend. That is not the way you want that to go. All right. Kill everything in one hit. I don't, I don't really need to fight. All right, Merilith is tough. We'll avoid it for now. Um, need to come up. I need better. I need Kiraja with a J so that I can. Um, I can heal more <laughs> because Kiraga with a G is fine, but it only targets one character and Ash is the only one that can use it. And granted, she's going to be the only one that can use Kiraj, Kiraj, uh, Kiraja as well, but like, if it heals more and does, like, it, eh, either way, Merilith will have to wait. It's fine. It's a tough one. That thing hits, that thing hits super hard. Um, yeah. And it's very fast. Interesting. So this person has, this is the gambit set up. They have Vaughn, uh, Vaughn as Bowbreaker, uh, Shikari, uh, slot one, ally any, action remedy, slot two, ally any, phoenix down, slot three, foe, HP greater than or equal to 70% steal, uh, slot four, foe, highest max HP attack, and five, self, Libra. With Fran, who is a red battle mage or an archer, they have HP, uh, less than or equal, ally HP less than or equal to 30% Raga. Hold on. Can Pinello use Kiraga? Off check. Um, slot two ally HP less than or equal to 60%. Uh, Kira. Uh, slot three ally any raise. Slot four ally van, van, von decoy, which should use decoy more. Um, slot five ally any protect. Slot six ally any regen. It's actually two. Slot seven, foe, any slow. Slot eight, foe, highest max HP attack. So Fran's just, just healing. She's not doing anything. Uh, Pinello is a monk black mage. Ally HP less than 40% high potion. Foe, any percent blind, which I don't have. Uh, ally, any percent phoenix down. Ally, any percent chronos tier. Ally, or er, foe, water weak, aqua. Foe, highest max HP attack and self leave. You know, there's some things there that I can't do, um, but that's okay. I don't, I don't need to do that. Cask of Serpent Wine Musk. Take this back to the Tavern Master in the Sand Sea. I don't know if I ever did this one. I think because I made it to Merilith and I was like, I can do this. And then one of the things that I'm finding that I'm doing 
with this playthrough is I'm running from fights if I know I can't win. You know? So, like, in that instance, like, I would have been pissed had I died. Huh. Pissed is a bit up in the air. I don't know. Something about this game just doesn't make me mad. Yet. Uh, I'm sure it'll happen. But, like, I would have been miffed because I would have been like, ah, damn it, I just put all that effort into beating that thing and then the Giza Plains when it's dry. I might go. I might not. Blind is useful. Uh, I usually like to have on back stuff, though. Hand of the Moon Ring, if you earned it from slaying the Earth Tyrant, it's only used in one item, but it is the powerful silver bow. You may not want to forget, add one, and end up farming the Ash Worm longer or later. I have one already, good. Pick up new hunts and getting clan rewards. If you've been following along, you only have one active hunt still, the Gill Snapper. The Gill Snapper may still be a bit of a on the challenging side, really. Check out a notice board like the one in the sand so you'll see seven new hunts available, might as well grab them. Most of them can be done now. Some will be done while progressing the story. None of them have petitioners here in Robin Oster, so we will need to do some traveling. Go visit Mont Blanc and Clan HQ. We should give you quite a few rewards because there's not much stuff. I'm actually going to go talk to Mont Blanc again because I killed the Earth Tyrant. Um, and I did a hunt in between the last time I talked to him and now. Oh, that's good. On the whole, this guide writer, the one that wrote the, the the walkthrough for this particular game, I think is better than the one that did the one for 10 and 10 2, personally. At least 10 2. 10 2 had a lot of flub ups in it. But it is what it is. Popopo, your award of justice already. You've been burning the midnight oil. Clan Centurio knows how to treat its hard working members. Here, a reward for your accomplishment. Your explosion's too hell. Hello, Axel. Keep up the splendid work. Here you defeated the Earth Tyrant. Impressive. The merchant's caravan send you this with their compliments. Keeping safe the routes of trade that no merchants need walk in fear through these lands. I mean, there's still other things. 1200 bucks. Feels like I should have gotten more for it. That's okay. Uh, all right, we'll take Orthos. Oh, look, it's Ultros. That's just ultra. It's a purple slime instead of a. Got caught thieving and I'd be happy to give back what I had done stole, but this monster came and stole what I stole and oh, better talk to in per better talk in person. Uh, better to talk in person. Yeah. It was cool. And onto the hunt. Remember, I'm just an intermediate. You'll have to speak to the petitioner in person. Wait. Who's gonna sue Square over Ultro? Themselves? Ah. The hunt is on for the Great White Mark. Will you be able to. Will you be the one to claim the kill? Opportunity knocks but once, Kubo. Number only says Oh boy. Hmm. You're not the only one with sight sight on the trick, the boy. I make it to the petitioner before you don't let it down it. Man, you ain't gonna move a bit. The antlion. Ooh, creepy. I had a row with my children. Got upset and ran into Lusu Mines. They don't realize the danger there. Please help. Wait, there's an antlion in the Lusu Mines? I wasn't there previous. Because it would have kicked your ass. Eh, it might be deeper in the mines too where I haven't been yet. That's possible. 
Who's here? Um, I might go kill Ultros because why not? All right, let's see. For now, I'd, I'd wait on attempting Trickster and Antlion, although the reward for Antlion, a bubble bubble, makes it very tempting to try now. Uh, I will be presenting these in the order. I recommend doing them just because it's a lot of there's no need to do them in this order, however, and you can take these on whenever you find for convenience. Here's a list of links to each of the hunts covered in the section. Uh, Orthros. Uh, I could do that. Gill Snapper. I, could, I, I think I might try and do Gill Snapper just. Uh, Ix to. Oh, I gotta go to. I gotta go to the second scene and pick up more, more hunts. Uh, again, I am not a completionist, and I will probably stop doing these hunts once I get to a point where I'm like, I just don't wanna do them anymore. But for the time being, I'm enjoying playing the game uh, considerably more than I had anticipated I would enjoy it. I mean, I knew I was gonna like playing this game. I liked this game previous. It's, this is just a weird one because it doesn't feel, I don't know if it's 12 is a very weird game because it doesn't quite feel like a Final Fantasy while at the same time feeling the most like a Final Fantasy Final Fantasy has felt almost ever like it just it just does and is and it's weird and uh, i like it because of it. um and, um and yeah mirrorless uh ix tab was an undead bear arms against this creature's bear arms against our very ancestors yet if we do not much harm will it bring i wait we're coming crazy i will go speak where is he? In Jahar. I should not have finished that Mountain Dew. Oh well. Feral Retreat. Oh, it's a Coriol. The Light has received many reports of pilgrims being beset by this fiend. We've tried to stop it to no avail. You must succeed where we have not. Mount Burrow is ace. Vorpal Bunny, Mutant Hare. I have need of a warrior, but to those in my village I cannot turn for one who feels a proper kinship with the wood do I wait. Yes, that's me. Mind Flare. Oh, I remember fighting these. these the warriors of the Gareth are strong and brave, but some creatures are beyond even our hand. We now face one such creature come to us. Jahara again. Red wing. Mutant stealing. This beast killed my partner and I want revenge. Problem is I end up to dishing it out. Where are you coming? Where? Where? Bill's petitioner can be found at the following location. You must speak In the Easter Sin. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, God. How many are there? Okay. Tomos. Uh, mutant Slavin, uh, and the Bean of Fortress. The Colossal Slavin Wilder rampages in the mountains. They say the Arcadian army roused it somehow, but it's our problem now. I'll speak with you, Aaron Nobina. Ah, uh, yes, Nobina Town. Oh, I haven't been there yet. Bray. It's a Bray. Most important delivery of the year, and some beast chooses my caravan to sup upon. Kill that thing and take back my goods. From its stomach? They like said it supped on you. Mosfer and high waist. Ugh, I don't like this. I might now. Although, I'm not really that much higher level than I was. I'm a little lower level than I'd like to be. Um, I think I only need like 10 more levels to really be at a point where I can game so fine um all right the ones that it recommends i do orthos or orthros gill snapper ixtab mind flare vorpal bunny feral retriever and atomos and carrot hmm well i'll do orthros and gill snapper because why not um go back to the overflow cloaca
because this is in essentially the same place. Wait, I gotta, I gotta, I have to partition here. Where's, uh, to find a contrite thief near the Garamseth Waterway. Which one are you? There we go, contrite thief. Oh, did you, did you see my bill? Thanks for coming. Uh, love, just now when someone cared enough to hear me troubles is all I needed. Oh, <laughs> well, true world. <gasps> Wait, that. Only winding you're up, dear. Oh, I still got some juice left in me. Ready to get down to business. If you've seen the bill, you know I need the horse roast hunted and stuffed and mounted. You can do that with like a slime. Oh, come. Well, I'll tell you, but only if you agree to do the hunt, love. So, interesting. Thank you, love. Though I hate to have such a fine young man as yourself see me in such a state. Well, you already know I'm a, 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 a thief. There, I said it. I wouldn't be much of a thief if I didn't steal from time to time. And this time I was partaking of some things in Samuel's house. That Samuel's never home. He's always down in the self sprawl talking to some kid. Well, he's practically begging to be robbed. Not being one to turn down such a clear invitation, I helped myself to some plunder. Only these kids caught me in the act. Well, you can imagine how frightened I was. A mob of kids chased, chasing after me shouting, Stop thief! grab her and whatnot. <laughs> Much easier being chased by proper adults, I find. Where was it? And of course, Garam safe wall, what away. That's the place that they chased me. Couldn't scarcely breathe by this point, mind you. Still, somehow, came to slip. No sooner than I'd stopped to catch me breath, than that orthros reared its well head, I suppose. Not being in a condition to fight, I threw down my plunder and then ran fast as I could. What time I made it back to Lota, kids had got, gotten the grown-ups involved and I found myself pinned in tight. Well, it seemed to me I'd done, gone from the frying pan into the fire. Lucky for me, Samal showed up just then. He's the one what I'd stole from. Heart of gold, that one. Said he'd let it all be as water under the bridge if I just return everything that what I took. Only this Orthros made off with all me plunder, and I'm in no condition to get it back from you, as you surely see. So you gotta help me. Kill that Orthros. Get back them things I stole. Else they'll hand me over to the Imperials. And then it's Nalbina for me. The notorious Sikh by the name of Daguza's said to be there. Dare and think what he'd do to a dainty flower like myself. Don't let him send me away. That Orthros was off in the south end of the waterway. Only, uh, he's particular about who he'll attack. At least it was. That's what Samuel said. Don't let me down. I'm begging you with all the beg I got left. I'm gonna guess he only attacks women's. Okay, let's see. But Fran, yeah, that's what I thought. Only attacks the women's. That's okay. That's kind of who I really like. All right. So I've got Bosch in here for now. He'll leave when I get to the point where I want to be. All right. Back here, back to channel 10. Way to the west edge, head south into the west loose country. Also, I'm, I'm essentially going to the exact 
same place I'd gone. Yeah, we get the boom. I'm back up. No. Odd. Slam it. There we go. Now I can build this damn thing. Good as hell. How did I do this so effortlessly? In my previous attempt, and yet I can't do it this time. There we go. Oh yeah, I gotta see if Penelope can use it. Because if she can, we're gonna set up a gambit. She has an extra. Damn, let's if only she could use a sooner as well, she'd be way I'm not really taking advantage of the fact that she can use dark or like black magic and mono magic as well. the candle in the urn by the saved person. Oh. Well, here's where I'll fight it. But before then, a save. I not. What are you? A map that I never got. Candle reveals hidden areas on the, your map to carry himself water. Oh. Oh, well, hot damn. Would you look at that? Back in the Garam Cypher. Wow, away. And of course, he only wants this. Alright, he only wants this. Here's what we're going to do. Fran, and then we're going to swap Fran out for Penella, or for uh, Voltier. Yeah. No. Penella.
Come on, just attack. I guess he's not Altros because he's not. He's 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 not. He's he's his, he's his stupid slime cousin. Is susceptible to sleep. I kind of want to wait a minute and they'll do more damage. Um, trying to think, how can I do more? I die here, I die here. It's fine. Oh, 
Oh, that's right. Both your hands. Oh, he's blind. Look at that. Dope as hell. Vaughn, why do you suck so much? You have like the coolest quickening. Oh, I should have missed charged with bash. Spun on your ass, dude. Twenty-five LP. Fourth, conquer. Vanquish. I could have gone a little better, but it's it's relatively fine. Blind poison silence and slow. You not have the good kind? Oh, you do. Go save because why not? Better to save than be saved. Dumb thing. I don't know why I wasted Phoenix Downs. The dumb thing that I've said since uh, my playthrough of um, Team Bike Runner because my friend Ryan was like, hey, or I was making a joke, like, it's better. To be safe than sorry, and he goes, it's better to save, or better to be saved than sorry. And so, just won't stop saying that. that game was so. Oh man, I have so many fun memories. It was that was early on in my my streaming career, and I was such a, a, a blossoming young man. Didn't quite know what was gonna happen. Turns out nothing, <laughs> nothing happened. <laughs> I just do this for fun. <laughs> Which is most of it. No, it's like 100% true. <laughs> I do just do this for fun. Oh shit. The magic ain't gonna wake me up. Uh, 
Run away. Man, I don't. Fuck it. I don't want to be near that. I'm going the wrong direction. Oh, I hate this. Oh, I hate this so much. Fine. All of my party members are dead. Elemental suck. I should probably revive my former party members again. I'm running out. Phoenix out. Do I have to grind? I don't really want to. Because of the water. This sucks. I went the wrong direction. Uh, so what you're telling me is I didn't need to come this way in the first place. And I did anyway because I'm, I thought, oh, hey, look, uh, 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 shortcut. It's okay, there's a save crystal right here. Might as well use it. Just want to get back to town, man. I don't want to deal with this shit anymore. I gotta get back and finish up this quest. Alright. Back from 
Moment. I'm about to get a reasonable amount of gil for this fight. Could be better, but 3,800 isn't anything I'm gonna like be mad about. Really? Rand's just hit. Okay. I think I'm gonna turn off Chorology. As good as it is. Only really good. Kill this damn thing. squad let's go have gotten harder since I've come down like they weren't this difficult when I first came they were reasonable did they do damage to me absolutely they didn't like oh. getting a little frustrated with this because this, this game seems like I don't know just this one particular section seems like it got way difficult for no reason You said you'd get in and you'd have Oh hello there, Samu. Oh, let's see. Recovered my things. Or lucky you found someone willing to help you. you. Can't hope to get by in life stealing and pilfering from others. We help each other, or the whole thing falls apart. Off with you now. Hopefully you've learned something from all this. It won't do so well for you to, if we catch you stealing again. Thank you. Thank you. All of you. I've learned me lesson. Yes, so I have. I know I'll probably never see you again. But if you ever see a lonely seek in the street corner, you know, I have to keep my dreams where they belong. You and me, 
It would never work out. Look <sighs> at okay, I said. This for help me help. It ain't much, but it ain't stolen neither. You should be commended. Hunting a creature for the sake of a scoundrel like that seek. I don't care how large the bounty is. A rare soul who has the courage to risk his own life to help another. Speaking of which, I think you ought to have this. It's a blackened fragment of some sort of medallion. It was given to me by a man who said I should pass it on to someone who'd shown great courage. I doubt he could object to me giving it to you. He was quite a character, I can tell you. Spent most of his life as a sky pilot. He just decided to mend his ways before the war broke out. He planned to start a new life in Nabudis, his home as a boy. But his dream died with the city. He came here a broken man and died not long ago. I was a sky pirate myself, so I'd rather not too many people knew. Some choice, profession, wouldn't you say? Anyway, through a course of events I won't bore you with now, I've saved this man's life. And that's why he entrusted me with, that, uh, with part of this medallion. He never told me what it was for or what it did. I got the impression it was important. Now, I want you to have it. it. Belongs with you. A blackened fragment. Cool. An important item for a site. You may not have started. Oh? Oh? All right. Um, let me get back. Oh, I just realized. Once I get to Final Fantasy, uh, actually, Final Fantasy 13 has kind of a slow walk speed too. Shit. Shit. But, like, Final Fantasy 15, or, uh, I'm gonna be jumping a lot. I'm gonna be jumping a lot. A lot. Jump a lot. Because that's the fastest way to get around in that game. It's another great day for plan plans and tour. Oh. Oh, boo to you. Damn seeks. Being all big and I can't walk around. I go talk to Clay Provisioner though. You might have some stuff for me. Oh, which way do I got? Enough. Oh. I should talk to Kitchen. My sword, bitch. Well, Mr. Example left the wood or not. Step up, right up, lad, blah, blah, blah. Ooh. I don't have decoy, I'm gonna buy that. I don't have drain, I'm gonna buy that. Let me steal some stuff. I'm gonna keep those. I was right to keep the moon ring. Go figure.
Well, I'm going to sleep really uneasy tonight. <laughs> Still, I tell you what, like you, if you happen to be watching me when that happened, you would have seen the true face of a shocked and horrified man where a spider directly in front of you. Like, it's always off-putting, especially when they're like, like his body was tiny and he had like really thin legs. And like, I'm so zoned in on doing this that like, I wasn't really paying any attention. And like, oh, oh boy. Oh, oh. Uh, I'm gonna keep that because you never know what's unpurified ether. Oh man, Did I get rid of him? Hold on, in addition to the key loot from before, you now have the hor Horak Beast Flame, which is used in crafting a key item. Kalpik Jar, you only get one of these in the game and only one is needed for synthesis. Keep it. You can hang on to it until you get the other items or sell it now. I like holding on to the loot used for synthesis for major items, but that's usually just my paranoia. <laughs> uh, for sure, however, keep the Arcana, Domestic, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so I can get rid of the thing here. These are goods. Um, I can buy both of them. Burning fangs. The war axe is good. Let me let me buy. Sage's monograph. And this, and then I'm buying this. Is this an axe? Uh, buy this. I want to buy that. Hi, what do you have? I want nothing that I want to buy. <gasps> ah, that's okay. I don't need it. Okay. Good. Oh, yeah, I wanted to go fight the kill snap. You know what, though? Not tonight. Not tonight. I want to go back. Save, make my way to the Giza Plain eventually, and I'll find this fucking thing. South. stream i got nothing accomplished within the game well that's not true that's not true i did a lot actually well okay lots of bit of a misnomer as well i did enough <laughs> uh the paranoia of saving will never leave me and i think that's a good thing. 36 36 Oh, I didn't realize I forgot to turn that up when I took a break. Anyway, um, I, I, I didn't really accomplish anything. We moved the story along a little bit. We're in part four. 
mention that earlier. Um, I'm doing a bunch of side quests right now. So the whole reason I'm doing side quests and the whole point of side quests in the first place is to, it's, it's like grinding, but not quite. It's just, you know, leveling your characters through fun side things instead of just running around in a circle, getting into fights and just hoping your characters survive and do all this other shit. So, you know, I'm genuinely okay with doing some of these. They're, they're fun. They're proving to become a little more challenging than I'd like them to be ultimately right now, but it's fine, I suppose. Um, I sh tomorrow's Friday, uh, because I'm back to work and I don't have like a week off. My schedule is essentially back to normal for the time being, which means that like Mondays are are no stream. Fridays have the potential to be no stream. It is possible I will stream tomorrow, and it's possible I won't stream. I make no problem. Saturday, however, I'll be back for sure. Um, probably put another four, four to six hours into this. Um, and Sunday, I'm not doing my normal Sunday thing for the next week or two. Uh, so I should be able to do a longer stream similar to what I did this past Sunday. So um, expect another probably... Anywhere from four to ten hours <laughs> of Final Fantasy XII within, uh, over the week. Uh, and then probably, actually we'll say anywhere from four to twelve hours. Because we'll consider Friday. Um, and then, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping, I'm going to look at the calendar, 13th day. If I could finish this by the end of next week, I'd be really happy. Um, not for any other reason than like I want to start 13 before August uh, because I have, I have two I have two games before 15 um, and 13 I think when I played through it last I think it took me like 3 to 50 hours or something most of these, like, it's funny, post six, each of the games has been like a minimum of 30 hours. Um, eight was like 40. I think I put 40. Nine, I put like 35. I mean, according to Steam, Summer Sale's not still going. It is past 10 a.m. Pacific. There's no way. Did just not update? Must not update. It didn't update. <laughs> um, all right. Um, but according to Steam, I have 39 hours in Final Fantasy IX. We'll knock like four hours off of that for how long it sat before I started streaming it. We're 35 hours. I think eight's the one I spent the most time with so far. Yeah, because 10 was like 30. Ish. Uh, 10 2 is only like 20. I have 50 hours in Final Fantasy 6. 30 hours in Final Fantasy 5. It is amazing to me that I only have 12 hours in Final Fantasy 1. <laughs> it, it makes sense. From 15 to 15 hours in 2 and 16 hours in 3. So, like, you know, I spent time. Oh, I think I have 40 hours in Ranger of Paradise. Okay. So yeah, I mentioned it before. Final Fantasy VIII has the longest, the most amount of, of parts, episodes um, of the playthrough on YouTube, 13. And then 10, uh, I just finished doing the editing and rendering as well. Um... That's done. Ooh, I remember uh, I'll have. Uh, by the time you see this particular, I should hopefully be on Final Fantasy 13 3 Lightning Returns. Or Lightning Returns Final Fantasy 13. Um, by, the, by the time you see this on YouTube, if you watch. Please do. They're, 
just good to have them. Um, and yeah, yeah, that'll do it. Um, thanks again for joining me. Have yourself a good rest of your week. Have a good weekend. Hope you'll stop by again in the future. And until next time, I need to press buttons before I can do that. Um, until next time. Bye.